Hello everybody, it's Susan and welcome. I am doing something different today. I'm doing a DIY um, face mask. These are the things that you're going to need. Some pins, thread. I'm using, um, it's upholstery thread so it's strong. Needles. I like to... Um, sew by hand so you can do this by machine if you want but I like to do it by hand you'll need a ruler scissors elastic and um, cardboard for like a template you'll need the material and these are just twist ties that you get in baggies in the box so you can add them for your uh, nose piece to bring it tight along your nose those and the material is I'm using is not cotton you can't use cotton or you're not supposed to it protects your pillow from dust mites and and whatever so I'm going to be using that I have my template and I've already cut it out from here to here it is 25 centimeters which is nine and three quarter inches and from here to here it's 17 centimeters six and three quarter inches so what you would do is you would um, trace the material and then cut and you need two pieces so I just um, you know it's the pillowcase so there is two pieces here so I'm just going to trace it with a pen I've already started And then you're going to cut. So now I'm going to pin along this side and along this side and then I'll be sewing it. Okay, I am finished sewing. Now I will turn it inside out. Lay it flat. And then measure um, approximately an inch and a quarter from the edges and mark them. It also depends on the size of your uh, elastic. This is fairly thick so it has you have to leave enough room to fit in there. And then the other side. And 
then draw a line so then you fold the material in to that line and then uh, pin them pin it you have to make sure you um, sew in order to be able to thread the um, elastic through because that's what you're going to do you're not going to sew the edge here you're just sewing along the one side and then this elastic has to go through that's for your ears Before I fold the other side, I'm going to put in the nose piece here. I am going to put it in approximately like that. Uh, I have to make sure it is right in the middle. So. <clears throat> to measure I guess there's the edge of it two and a quarter there's the other edge and it's a little bit more to one side so I'm just gonna pull it over a bit bringing it right to the edge. I'm going to try and get it in the middle. over a tiny bit too much. <clears throat> That's all right. So now, making sure it's right to the end, I'm going to pin it. it doesn't slide down actually I can just pin it right through it it's only paper paper and wire so I'm pinning that like that and then that like that okay so I'm just going to stitch around here just so it doesn't uh, go anywhere Just going to stitch a couple stitches there. Okay, so now that's in there. going to pin, turn this edge and pin it. Good. Okay, I finished sewing. Oops. And I've cut my, my um, elastic to about nine and a half inches. I'm going to put it through with the uh, safety pin. I'm going to feed it through. Um, Pin them both together and then see how it fits and then I'll know if I have the right size or not. So, so 
just start feeding it through like this. Okay, I, um, I've got the right size for the elastic. It is, for me anyway, it is just nine and a half. And then, so actually, um, eight and a half inches of this of elastic for me. So now I'm going to sew the elastic together. Okay, I've finished it now. I fed it through both sides. I sewed I sewed the elastic and I pushed it inside here, the part that's sewn, so it's not on your ear. That's it. So stay tuned, I am going to show you next how to make hand sanitizer. So now I'm going to make some hand sanitizer. You'll need a measuring cup, a alcohol, you can use six, as low as 60% alcohol, but uh, the higher the better. I have 99% aloe vera gel. I have some uh, essential oil and a container to put it in. So what I'm going to do first is measure the alcohol, I believe. Okay, I have another measuring cup here too. Um, what I'm going to do, instead of putting the alcohol in first, I'm going to measure um, one third of the aloe vera in this uh, measuring cup. And I think I'm just going to pour it, it's a lot quicker. about one third. And now I'm going to just put the one third in here. Okay. Now I'm going to put the alcohol in in here. Okay, and that's two-thirds alcohol. And okay, that's approximately two-thirds. this back into here so that I can mix it. I'm going to add the lavender in. I'm going to put about, oh, let's see, four drops in.
that's it, really. You just pour it in these containers and then use it. Need more than I needed. <laughs> so you give them a really good shake. And that's it. You've got your hand sanitizer. Okay, thank you for watching. And have a great day. Bye for now.